Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily inspiration card reading. Thank you all so much for the support you give this channel. It means the world to me. When you like, share, subscribe, you're really helping me as a person and my channel, but you're also helping to get a message out there which hopefully could bring somebody some peace. So again, thank you so much. If you would like a personal reading with me, just go to angelsouls444.com. We could tap in and see what your uh, guardian angels want to say to you to see what archangels are around you. Or you can choose to do an Akashic Records reading where we can see what energies from different timelines might still be affecting you, at least right now. This is how those Akashic Records readings are going. Eventually, we might be getting some higher messages, but for now, that's where we're at. Okay, so for today, we have gray. Learn to scan your body. The number is 29, and it reduces to 11, which is a master number. You see 11, 11, right? Here's the thing with gray. Gray can feel like we're in a gray area. Again, this whole messaging of we're not out of the old way. We haven't um, completely gotten into the new way. We're in this place of in-between. So when we say, you know, learn to scan, well, the card says, not me, <laughs> but like the card says, uh, learn to scan your body. Where are you holding tension? Where are you holding um, fear? You know what I'm saying? Like wh what starts to work when you're uh, feeling a little out of balance? Do you get lower back pain? Do you start to get a stomach ache? You know, the lower back pain can be sacral chakra. The stomach pain can be the solar plexus. Do you get a headache? You know, that's the third eye. It could be a blocked crown chakra as well. So really pay attention to, and, and don't dismiss what your body is trying to tell you. I'm also getting the message here to check with an expert, of course, but um, some of you might be following like a food and eating plan that's not working for you. And the example I'm thinking of, um, years ago I was trying to, you know, go vegan or no, I was doing vegetarian at that time. But anyway, I started eating a lot of tofu. Well, it turns out tofu and my body, they don't work well together. They don't play nice <laughs> together. It could be that kind of thing. In your quest to be healthy, you know, something may be really off. So evaluate that. Give your body what it's asking for, including rest. If you need rest, take it. All right? So we're going to leave it there. Have a beautiful day, guys. Bye-bye.